Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play the Oracle Trail 2, I am the Black Shadow, and uh, Happy New Year everyone, it is 1857. Uh, yeah, hadn't planned for this to happen folks, gotta say, we're not too far away from Sacramento now folks, and I'm hoping we can make a dive for actually getting there, hopefully in this video, that'd be pretty awesome. However, it's been an awful long journey for sure, hence as we've, what, clock clocked up, coming up to 2,000 miles travelled now. From leaving beginning of May, it is now January. And as you can see, the temperature... Temperature sucks, everyone. It is uh, an unfortunate state of affairs, but we have to push on nonetheless. Don't know how our supplies are at the moment, but I don't think they're too great. You better not say it. Hey, look here. There's a divide in the trail. Which Thank way do you. you reckon we ought to go? At least you didn't freaking say which way is west, because I would have literally punched you. Uh, I don't know. Pa says we're going to California, and that's west of here. So maybe that's the road we ought to take. Well, your pa knows what he's talking about. Well, heck. Nobody ever asked me for advice, and I'm not sure I should offer any. Why are you part of this video game experience? Really? This venture to California has been a miscalculation. Let's go to Oregon. You're off the wagon train. Let's go to California. The alternative, of course, is heading up to Fort Hall. But we're not going to do that. That's going the wrong way. As our wagon axle breaks. Ah, uh, shit. We weren't able to repair it. We're not getting many repairs. We're not getting any repairs or anything. That sucks. Oh well, we shall push on. At least we can follow the lake at least, but uh, yeah. The gravelly ford of the Humboldt River. Good news everyone, it's frozen! Let's cross. Ah, oh, I don't need to look awesome. Wesker has frostbite. There's something quite amusing about that. I don't know what it is. But there's something about it. Wesker is suffering from a hardened skin. <laughs> oh, the irony is amazing. It is amazing. We'll grab you on the affected area, and we're going to stop for a short little time. Howdy, we're having to lighten the load on our wagon. Oh, that's terrible. I've carried my mother's framed mirror all the way from home. It's with great effort that I cast off this last gentle reminder of the dear friends and family I've left behind. But our success in reaching the end of the trail is of greater import. You know, I feel tempted to say, well, I'll borrow it. You know, if you don't need it, I I'll take it. But then the last time we found a mirror, we couldn't do jackal with it. So, fine. None save to do whatever you can to make the work on your animals a little easier. Lighten your load, rest them often, take good care of them. If you lose your animals, you're in danger of losing your life. Duly noted. Why do you think I have 14 oxen? This is for a reason, my dear. I suppose while we're here, do you have any money? You do not have money. Is there anything else I could get from you that I might be of some use? Any preserved potatoes? Uh, what are you for five sacks? Set of clothing? I mean, I guess. Uh, fine. I'll do that. You got anything Howdy, else on you? Have, I've carried. Anything else might be of some interest to me? Ooh, pickles might be a good idea. Two kegs of pickles. Sack of sugar? Deal. I don't need that much sugar. I really don't. Alright, that's cool. We're going to rest for a couple of days, because that's a bit chilly. That's much better. Don't bother me right now. I ain't got time for idle chat. You again? I mean, it's not like, what exactly are you going to hunt around here? Look at the bloody place! Useless. Let's move on. <laughs> 
Raven! What are you doing, man? Come on! Why you gotta get a cold, man? I mean, it's like only below freezing. Jeez! We're making our way across the mountains now. Altura has frostbite now. Ugh. And it is very cold. Okay. We'll wait for conditions to improve. No, oh, I don't want to wait a whole bloody week. Oh, shit. We did. Oh, well. Let's push on. At least we got a week's rest in. I suppose that's better than nothing, right? The French Ford Trading Post. I suppose you should better say hi. This guy's going to charge us out of our teeth, isn't he? Oh, uh, it's going to be expensive, but we're going to buy some stuff. Get some cheese. Some pounds, of, a couple pounds of butter. Should get some fruit. We don't want to start having to deal with, like, um, you know, not having fruit or veg and the problems that will come along with that. So we're going to get hold of some of this for sure. Make that ten. Potatoes is low. Hmm. This is where we're starting to struggle now. We have no spare axles. Let's hope that doesn't go bad. We'll just buy that. Cheers. Anyone else I can Hi, trade with? Friend. Fine day, isn't it? Be warned. What do you have for me, my dear? How much have you got? 95 pounds of salt pork for an ox? That's very tempting. Set of clothing? Deal. Howdy, friend. Anything else? Fine. No more than I... Loudenum. Mittens. Uh... Dollars. Thirty dollars. Not a chance. No. 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 You don't get how this game works, do you? Whatever. Let's push on. Shit, look at these temperatures. Yeah, I know. Shit. All right. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to stop for a little bit. Raven's not doing too great. The temperature is ridiculously cold right now. It's only getting worse. Jesus. This is why. Uh, this is. I did not think. I thought. I thought. I was considering. Well, maybe we should leave in April, not May. It wouldn't have made a bloody bit of a difference, would it? Really. Wouldn't have made any difference at all. Just white wherever the hell you look. Yeah, he's still not doing great. We're gonna have to push on. Lassen's Meadows. We cannot gather hay for our animals because it's like freezing. 2,000 miles, everyone. All right, we are gonna rest here for two more days. I am a bit nervous about supplies though. We are starting to run a bit low on. 2,000... Jesus. Problem is, there's nothing to hunt. Hell is that? Is that a, uh, a deer? Could be a wolf. <laughs> Fuck, didn't read up the gun. It's really annoying that the real mechanic doesn't always work as it should do. Ugh. Oh, what a shot! That was a good little shot, actually. I'm happy with that. See if I can pick off one more. Yes. There we go. It's better than nothing. Right. I'm actually going to bring the Vashers down and Mega for a short time. Just to help space out our supplies, because we are running a bit low. Which sucks. Alright. Have to do this, so turn, turn. Okay, so I think we want the California Trail, I'm pretty sure. 
the Applegate Road takes us up towards Jacksonville, which is not the route we want to take. So we're going to take the California Trail. Yeah, that would take us up that way. More desert, everyone. Ah, shit. Again, we can't gather any hay. Do we actually have any hay for animals? I don't even know. Probably not. No, we'll push on. Oh, guys, come on. It's been colder. The Humboldt Sink. Right. Now there's going to be roots everywhere. I do believe the northern route is the one more traveled. Must be a good reason for it. Okay. Anyone else? Maybe we better consult our guidebook before deciding which road to take. Doesn't help me. I hear the Donner Party took the Truckee route. And look what happened to them. No siree. I say we should go the Carson route. Mm. I like the sound of that route. So there's various routes that we can take. Okay. So, the Truckee or the Carson route. Let's have a look at our uh, guidebook and see what this says. Wherever it is. Carson route. The Carson route proceeds south from the Humboldt Sink. Deep sand follows. Can turn to patches of quicksand following the occasional heavy rains. Well, it's, everything's frozen, so that's fine. Which will take us, we means we have to push through the 40 mile desert. Ugh. But then we do reach some, some trading posts. Which isn't too bad. Or we take the trucky route, which I don't know where that is in the book. Right, okay. Not really around, is it? Ah, uh, the Batworth route from Trocky Meadow to Ranch. Right, not really much here. That's going towards Missouri. Yeah. Okay, then. We're going to take the Carson route. Sounds a bit more safer to me. We're going to take that. Especially if it does... I mean, if we have to push through some bloody desert, fine. But, which actually brings up a point. Changes. We're actually going to bring up the rations back up to full because this is going to suck. But if we can get through to some trading posts, we can sort of scrape our way through. That's the hope here. We can try and scrape our way through as best we can until we reach uh, Sacramento. It's going to suck, but it's better than nothing. Well, this place looks pretty desolate. Yeah, there's absolutely nothing here. Okay. Here we go! Quicksand time! Quicksand? We better be careful! Thanks. Uh, I don't think there's any quicksand through here. You're off the wagon train! We're just gonna push through. I don't think there's very much we can do here. We're just gonna have to push through as best we can. You notice that we're above freezing now, which I guess is good. Ah, shit. Ain't nothing we can do. Let it go. I'm not so sure. We can't just leave it there. We have to do something. We're going to try and rescue it. We were able to rescue the animal. Thank goodness. Whew. Oh, God damn it. It's all this rough trail is killing us. We managed to repay it, folks. Hooray! More desert, everyone! Aren't we so thrilled? I feel like I've been eating dust soup all day. It's been so thick. We tied masks for cloth on the oxen to filter the dust. They still appear to suffer from it, though. I've learned to drink just one cup of water in the morning to slake my thirst. What little we have has to stretch. 
Yeah. I'm so glad I got those water kegs. That was a genius idea. Using a couple of poles and a blanket can make a bit of shade during the nooning. Getting out of the sun and wind does refresh one a bit. But I don't know if we should do any nooning in the desert ahead. Maybe be best just to keep going no matter what. That's such a bizarre word, nooning. That's such a strange word. You got any goodies for me? Pounds of meat. 75 pounds. I can't give you a winter coat. I'll give you a keg of gunpowder. That's acceptable. Alright then. So we're going to travel by day again. We don't need to wait until sunset. It's warm enough. It's cold already. Let's just get through here as quickly as we can. Of course, the water sucks. <sighs> Fucking dust from the wagons. We're just going to push through. we got to get out of the desert. Here we are! Ragtown! This is a brilliant piece of news. It means we're almost there. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Well, say hi. Man, my supplies are fucked. We've got, like, almost nothing. Right. I'd rather wait until we actually get to an actual proper uh, town. I know it says Ragtown, but there's another proper town to come along, so I'd rather wait until we get there. Here we are, this is Sierra Nevada's. The Eagle Ranch Trading Post. We're just going to push through. I really don't want to trade in these places. I sure would like to stop here for a bit. I could use some fresh supplies. Yeah, well, I'm in charge and I say no. Besides, there should be some uh, actual physical towns for us to visit. I don't know if this counts as well. This is just a trading post, so we're just going to we're gonna ignore it. This is more like it. Thank the heavens. Ooh, hello. Say, you folks heading out on the trail. If you're near to running out of it. God damn you. I know who you are. That was fun. Wanted! Apple J. Fleur. Wanted for horse theft. I'll be keeping an eye out for him. Hello! Ah, oh, my friend. A fellow traveler through this great land. You are indeed lucky to cross paths with me this day. I have uh -oh. a single bottle left of my finest cattle liniment. Being my last, I'll let it go for a mere two dollars. <sighs> Works for any draft animal, not just cattle. Keeping your animals on the road is vital in your journey. Just rub a bit of my liniment on their legs each morning, and they'll step as lively as spring calves. Why am I not convinced by this? I advise you to take me up on this valuable offer before someone else snatches up this, my last bottle. Uh, oh, excuse me, I have to be going. Get out of my face. All right. Stables, don't need anything here. My money sucks the problem. Has anyone got money? I need the dollars. Someone must have the dollars. Come on, guys. You know you want my dollars. No, I want your... Whatever. Has anyone got $40? Six oxen. Are you... Gotta be fucking kidding me. It's called I'm in a bad shape with uh, supplies. I don't have anything that anyone's interested in. I can't trade all that. Ten dollars for an ox. No, I'm not doing twenty for four. All my sorted meat for four hundred fifteen do for for twenty dollars. I think I have to do this. I can get more. You have a deal. 
I just need the money at the moment. Have you got something for ten dollars? No. No. No! That lady was offering me ten for one! I'm thinking we're gonna give you ten for two. You must be freaking out your mind! How you guys are enjoying the music? Fifteen. No. Damn, you guys are like brutalizing me here. Fine. Ugh. I need the money, folks. I need some money on hand. I got some shit to do here. Ooh, hello. Pardon me, folks. I was wondering whether you've seen this character. Nasty Jack Finley. He's a cattle rustler, horse thief, an all-round troublemaker. Mm, can't say I have, officer. He's even been rumored to kill a man. Though ain't no proof of it. Yet. But he's due for a hanging, that's for sure. Naughty boy. I'd recommend you steer clear of him. He can be a mean one. And if you see him... Notify the local authorities as quick as you can. Well, good day to you. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. See, some people can be nice and friendly. Well, I just finished checking my supplies, and I can't say we're really in need of much of anything. Mm, I can't agree. I think I'll mosey you over to the store they got here and see if there's anything I can use. You might want to check your animals and be sure they're okay. If need be... You might be able to get a few fresh ones here before we move on. <laughs> a few fresh ones. <laughs> uh, you have no money. Fine. Ooh, the physicians. Hello. I've been told you're looking for a doctor. <laughs> you look absurd. I'll do the best I can. Mind He's you, even got a picture of him up there! It's the same fucking like picture! Oh my god! You're fucking crazy! If you see any plants with... I cannot... I cannot talk to you anymore. Bacon! We're just going to have to squeeze through whatever the fuck I can now. Get some celery. Coffee beans. We need some of that. Oh, man. That is expensive. Ugh. I think we're okay. I don't think there's anything else we particularly need. We don't need any more salt. We ain't travelling far enough to really need that anymore now. But I hope our wagon axle doesn't break, folks. That could be unfortunate. Alright. I think we're okay, folks. I think we've got enough. Oh, shit. I didn't... Piss. I didn't buy any of that, did I? Oops. Ah, oh, well. Better buy, get some of this back again. Let's splurge our cash, everyone. Uh, let's just buy everything I can find. We'll get some cake. Make everyone feel a bit better. There we go. I have got not much more on me now. I have got $7.24 on me. That's all I have. Jesus. Alright. Let's get out of here, folks. The good news... We're nearly there. Let's get through to Sacramento. Let's get it. Let's make this.
Okay. Are you shitting me? I... Are you kidding me? Wow. I've been recording for four hours. I figured this would be done in about 15 minutes. Wow. I do not know what to say, everyone. I am so sorry. We made it... We made it to within maybe a hundred miles of Sacramento. If... Like, Sacramento is, like, maybe a little bit further from, like, from here and down a bit more, like, down and left. Sacramento is about there. Wow. Well, ultimately, this game... was not designed to be run on modern systems. The game, for some reason, does not offer me any re any ability to save. So I suppose this sort of thing can happen. I am so sorry, everyone. Wow. It's painful. We almost made it as well. We, ha we, weren't, we weren't defeated by disease. We weren't beaten by illness. We weren't beaten by the weather. We weren't stopped by being attacked by wild animals. We weren't halted by native Indians or something like that. We crossed deserts. We scaled mountains. And the run has ended because the system has crashed. You know, in almost five years, I've never had anything end like this. Wow. I... I honestly can't justify redoing this and going through four hours. I... I can't. I'm sorry, folks. You guys understand. You've seen the state of address a couple of weeks ago. There's so much stuff for me to be doing. I bet it was Wesker's fault. He knew that we were so nearly... We nearly made it to Sacramento. Wesker, being his usual self, has, has thwarted my plans. He has stopped the game. He's probably found some devious way of, like... I don't know. Sending everyone back to Genoa and saying, you know, this is a pretty good place to stop and rest up and, and, and settle. God damn you, Wesker. It's all your fault. Well, I guess this is the end of our Norvu whatever the hell to Sacramento run. It has ended like this. I am so sorry, everyone, that this has happened, but the game doesn't offer me any way of saving.
There's nothing I can do. So, thank you for watching this run of the Oregon Trail 2. I don't know if I'm going to do another one. I may well consider doing more Oregon Trail stuff. Because it has been kind of fun. I don't know if I would do Oregon Trail 2 though. I may decide to look for, look into uh, other versions of the game. And of course there is the... Um, the, uh, the, the ver well, I suppose the derivative of this uh, Oregon Trail. Which is the zombie version. Uh, which I am somewhat familiar with. And have been slightly tempted... To actually bring an LP whilst we're in this sort of uh, run of things, folks. So I might consider doing that. I don't know if anyone is familiar with that game at all. But that is going to be all for this run. And possibly, unless something surprising happens, is maybe the end of Oregon Trail 2. I don't know. I'll see what the comments say. But this is going to be the end of the run. So thank you guys very much for watching. Um... I don't know how to say it because I've never had a, a, a series end like this. This is absurd. Thank you to um, uh, Rigitsu for uh, sending me uh, this game. I have enjoyed the two runs. I legitimately have. It's been entertaining recording these. There's been some strange shit. DJ Shubby, the only person who in both runs who died. And he didn't even get sick. I didn't help him. He just... Got sick and died. Just like that. This game's a bitch. So thank you guys very much for watching. And uh... I guess blackshadow.exe is about to stop working as well. Thanks for watching and... I'll see you next time.